Hi, Alan Stratton from Meswood Turns. I love to make Christmas ornaments. That's partly why I co-host the Christmas Ornament Challenge every year for the past eight years. But one thing I like to do with mine is to use a wire hanger in it and not try and find one from the hardware, an eyelet from a, uh, from a hard, big box hardware store. One of you asked the question, well, how do you make them? And I searched my memory. Well, I don't think I have dedicated a video to making these wire hangers. So here goes. First thing that I, that I use is a round shape. And uh, it could be a drill bit of whatever size you want. So you have a full range of sizes there. Or a set of transfer punches will work also. Then a way to hold it. For a drill bit, I put it in the opposite way into my Jacob's chuck and it's just being held here. If you don't have it on your chuck, hold it some other way. So then, some wire. This is zebra wire and it is a 24 gauge. It could be heavier wire. I'm not sure I'd go much lighter than this. Need a way to cut the wire with a pair of cutters or pliers and then about three inches I think will do. Then a way to clamp onto the wire, so either vice grips or these guys or a pair of uh, non-locking pliers can work but it's a little bit harder to keep them going. So then take your wire and wrap it around the shape, put the two ends together again grab the two ends at the same time and then it's actually a simple matter of twisting it somewhat like a rope and not just and I like to give it a good heavy twist where there's not much of a valley between the strands and I think that will just about do it so and take it off unclamp and then trim to whatever size is appropriate for your Christmas ornament. Finally, you've drilled a hole for the loop. Glue it in with a little medium CA glue will do the trick. And you're off and running for your Christmas ornaments. I, every week I make a new video on wood turning. So this is Alan Stratton from Meswood Turns. We'll see you next week.